Mirgloff builds, and this is the fourth episode. And uh, off screen, once again, I replenished my wood supplies. And the plan for today is to build some houses. The first set of houses. And I need to make some tools first. But uh, the houses, they're going to be woodcutter houses since that makes sense. Like cabins for woodcutters. Makes sense because a lot of the very beginning industry for this town, which I've decided to name Mirgloff after me, of course. The town of Mirgloff. Why not? Uh, unless other people have some suggestions, leave comments below. And... Uh, yeah, so I was saying the uh, starting industry so far in this town of Mirgloff is wood cutting. Because look how much wood has been cut. And the location of the woodcutter uh, cabins or houses is going to be over here on the river. Quite a bit ways from the town hall, because the town hall is going to be towards the center of town. So I'm thinking on maybe on that side on that island there that looks uh well not that island but that sort of peninsula thing it's got some open space but actually no how about over here oh need to eat and i'll just clear a space for these cabins This should be good enough, at least for the first few. Uh, what I'll do is I'll build the first cabin uh, without doing a time lapse so that you can see uh, me build it. And then the, uh, the rest, uh, I think I'm going to build a total of three, uh, I'll do in a quick time, time lapse. And I'm getting some kind of lag. Yeah, I've been getting lag badly on this map for some reason. I've been doing fine on others, but... That is just awful. Hold on, let me stop here for a second. Alright, hopefully that should settle it. And how big do I want to make this cabin? Uh, let's go with... Six, seven, eight. Mm. Let's make it. Mm. No, eight's a good size. Eight is a good size for a cabin. So I need to cut down this tree. It's going to be in the way. All right. I'll place the wood down for the floor. And I want it to be by eight. So that means six by six wood floor interior. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. That should be good. And this cow is in the way, so I shall kill it. And this stuff's in the way. A lot of things in my way. It's okay, I can move them. Oh, why did I do that? Oh, well, that's good enough. And there. 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 And there. those even. And, hmm. Did I do that right? Yeah, I did that right. 
this looks a little weird because it's varying height. Let's get this done quickly though. Once again, something is in my way, but not for long. Oop. Probably going to need more wood than that. There we go. I only need oops, one space for a door. It's going to be a single door. These cabins aren't going to be anything too fancy. Oh. Surprise, surprise. Boy, uh, and I think I'm going to name these cabins, uh, you know, Woodcutter Cabin A1 or whatever, something like that. And if you uh, are watching these videos and want the cabin to be yours just uh, by what that mean is I'll just put your uh, YouTube name on the cabin with a sign and that will make it yours for these videos all you have to do is leave a comment saying I want cabin A and it will be first come first serve and if you don't get what you want you can uh, leave a comment for the next open cabin or house or whatever. Alright. And a little bit touch there. Almost done. And eventually I plan to build a mayor's house for my to keep my stuff because that little shelter is not going to be adequate for very long. I'm already running out of inventory space. And so that's something on the to-do list here shortly. Not sure when. I felt like I needed to build a couple of houses first. Also, by these woodcutter cabins, I plan on building a sawmill or a woodmill, something like that. What am I building? A door, that's right. And a staircase to get to the door. Put that there. Voila! Woodcutter cabin. And I will put furniture and stuff in there later. And I should probably explain uh, the rules. Uh, I'll do that later, but well, I can explain the rules quickly. Uh, the rules that I'm doing for myself is that each house, uh, one bed equals one citizen, and each house needs one food per citizen in that house. That's basically the rules pertaining to citizens. And I need to go to my little base before mobs start spawning. But then I'll do a time lapse of the next three how or next two cabins. Hey, okay, I'm back. Uh, I decided to build these off camera instead of doing a time lapse because you already see me built this in regular speed, so there's no need for the time lapse. But these are what they look like, they're pretty much the same. And if you want your YouTube account name per woodcutter, if you want to be a woodcutter, just uh, leave a comment below on which uh, house you'd like. 1B, 1A, 1C, and eventually when you do that, I'll move in some furniture, like a bed and a chest with some food. And I'll switch this uh, sign out and put your YouTube account name on it. And, uh, as far as the next project that comes, uh, I'm going to make a quarry and a forge or some place to 
smelt the uh, cobblestone at the quarry so that I can, oh, sorry about that, so I can make more different types of uh, buildings. I need more resources to do that. So in the next video, I'll be making a quarry. But if you enjoyed this video, I'll go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And thank you for watching.